Over in the U.S., with over 300,000 confirmed cases and 18,000 deaths, New York has been the epicenter of coronavirus outbreak in the United States. And with funeral homes unable to keep up, one New York City funeral home was found to have been storing bodies in rented trucks. Despite all this, President Trump says federal social distancing guidelines will not be extended. Our Isinje tells us more. On Wednesday, police were called to a neighborhood in Brooklyn after neighbors complained of a strong odor. The odor came from two rented trucks which were storing dozens of bodies after a funeral home was overwhelmed by the number of bodies from the COVID-19 pandemic and resorted to storing them on ice in rented trucks. Since late March, funeral homes in New York City have struggled to keep up with the number of bodies coming in. The city has set up temporary morgues, hospitals have been using refrigerator tractor trails to move bodies, and crematoriums have been backed up. Funeral directors across the city have called for help as they have run out of space. New York is just a portion of the 1,000-plus COVID-19 deaths the United States has reported each day. Despite this, U.S. President Donald Trump said on Wednesday, that the federal government will not be extending its COVID-19 social distancing guidelines when they expire on Thursday. The White House's 30 days to slow the spread guidelines were originally supposed to last 15 days, but were extended by an additional 30 days to encourage Americans to work from home and avoid unnecessary gatherings and trips. The director of the U.S. National Institute of Allergy and Infectious Diseases, Dr. Anthony Fauci, said Wednesday, that it's not out of question that the U.S. could have a viable COVID-19 vaccine by January 2021. He added that the government is quickly working to see whether a vaccine is effective before manufacturing hundreds of millions of doses. Scientists at Oxford University in the U.K. were a bit more optimistic. They predicted on Wednesday that a vaccine they are developing could be ready by September. Lee Seung-jae, Arirang News.